Sustainable Development Goal Number Four advocates for quality education and targets equal access to education for the vulnerable. For the last three years, we have embarked on a journey that sought to place children with disabilities in school. From 2016 to early 2019, we implemented a project on sports for inclusion, whose objective was to identify children with disabilities who are out of school and uh, enroll them in schools. Uh, these are children who had missed access to education due to various reasons, including maybe lack of resources. Sports for Inclusion has been our method of integration. Kupitia michezo hii, moja kwa moja huwa tunawahamasisha wazazi na walimu haswa kuhusu jinsi ambavyo waneza kufanya watoto wa mbwane shule mavu kukubali katika mashule zao. Ndo mana hii michezo moja kwa moja huwa inaandaliwa katika mashule kupitia mradi huu ama projekti ambo tunaita ni inclusive sports ambo moja kwa moja inaustiana moja kuhusu mambo ya michezo na elimu. Vile vile kupitia mradi huu wazazi wengi sana na walimu wameweza kukubali kuwaweka watoto ambao wanaishi na ulemavu ambao wana ulemavu katika madarasa na pia hata kujenga talanta zao. There has been a perception that children with disabilities only fit in the special schools and it has been our role to demystify this. Kuna shule zinazokubali watoto wenye wakona shida fulani tusemeza kutembea mwalimu na yaona huyu mtoto ni kibichukua na niko na watoto wengine wa kawaida atakuwa mzigo kwa na atakusumbua. Now we are going to learn about weather. Can you say weather? Weather. Weather. Victor but as time goes, Liliana Mahari kuna kanga mtoto ameanza kutembea mwaka mmoja Victor hakuwa anatembea lakini kuongea alikuwa anaongea nini but kwa kutembea alitelewa sana kicha kaona hata kama hatembei vile huyu mtoto ata improved upstairs Victor kwa sawa kumuliza maswali venye alikuja angeweza kusema namba ya mama yake ya simu jina yake mama yake anaishi wapi so teacher hata ana problem za kinitaka kinihitaji any time hata before hata before kurudi kwa kitabu ama kwa simu yake ataulizwa mtoto unaona children with disabilities are labeled as slow learners and many schools act in fear of pulling the school performance down therefore not every school welcomes this idea a school that is performing it's very hard to admit students with disabilities because we have that notion. The means that will come down. Our school, for example, KCP 2018, it was second in the whole district, 2018. Meaning, if a school can get position two in the district, so I am also concer concerned about the means that are score. It's a competitive school, actually. So I was very much uh, hard on, on this, to accept having the children uh, to join us. But let alone, uh, we went on with Adi, uh, we met, I met so many people from Adi group, we talked, until finally I accepted to have some children with that to come to school. Another factor that hinders admission are the resources, both personnel and infrastructure. So the government has a lot to do in terms of modification of these public, uh, existing public schools. We do not necessarily need to to build new schools to accommodate children with disabilities. We can do a little bit of modifications to these schools to accommodate everyone. We yeah, employ enough teachers who are specially trained to, to handle children with disabilities and offer support to them. And uh, also train the parents, like engage the parents, especially the, the parents of children with disabilities yeah, and as well as put in place the measures that are needed for these children to enjoy the same right equally, uh, offering their uh, assistive devices such as the wheelchair, the ramps uh, to the existing facilities, modifying the, the, the toilets for them to be able to access. Parents played a key role in the success of this project. We encourage them to form parent support groups, which we can say are a big success. Since we've started that group, we are able to move. Adim helped us to face our challenges, meet other parents with and without children living with disability. And this is when we felt that we are also okay, we don't have disabilities ourselves. So having a child with disability needs you to be strong and move on. And the wakati walikuja, they empowered us financially, 
Wani kutubati ya pesa kitu ya kwanza tuliweka kuku, pale shuleni, tukakua nyumba na mwadimu kuku, tukareka kuku. They didn't perform well, so we decided to leta mara ya kwanza azi kuperform vizuri mara ya kini, tukaona zinakufa na ukojo, so we decided to quit. Tukaondokea kuku, so hizo wa pesa zinyatuliuza, tukaanza muradi wa pili, ambao tulianza, tulikongia na mwadimu mku, akatombia tukwe tukisupply iskari shuleni, na maziwa, na mikate. Adi continue helping us as mothers, we really need you. Because we cannot do it without you. You know, some, some women, they, what they do, they stay at home without even knowing what to do. They just they are just there. But when you tell them to come and join groups, at least you come and you, you gain there. So I'm a Kasarani member there. So we don't just stay homes like housewives. We have a business that we do like a small business like for me. I make uniforms for schools. I can also make weddings. So I am not a housewife anymore. But the past year, <laughs> past years I was a housewife because I didn't have any help. I was just staying home, taking care of my child, wondering now what we like. Do. During this journey, we have had a number of challenges. We didn't have enough money to do assistive devices because other devices, other assistive devices, you realize are very expensive. So if you had to, to do like hearing aid for one child, which goes for like 80,000 for one child, and uh, the, you, you see you cannot serve so many kids. There are parents who, are, who had so, so much expectation, and um, if they see this is not coming for, they just withdraw and uh, they deny that child the right to participate in sporting activities, in child rights activities. Yeah, another challenge that we face is um, maybe uh, so many directives within the Ministry of Education which uh, somehow affected our project uh, activities. However, we can confidently say that the project has had a positive impact in the community. The community is able now to embrace the school. The community is now coming to the school as this is their school. They are taking this one as their school because they have children with disability in the school. So that kind of acceptance that this school can be able to include even on us with disability is changing the attitude the parents had. We change the parents' attitude that these children are automatically like any other child. Do you know children with disabilities are normally hidden? In some communities they are hidden, but here they have uh, they have voluntarily brought the children to the school to learn with the others and that one has made us to see these parents also seeing the school as a way of waking them up that there is something they are adding to the to to brain that after all this is a child like any any other me i've always prayed for ad to continue because they have made this life of these children to be children before others were looking at them as not people but since this boy came and the, uh, they have changed they have been children you can admire to be. They did the toilets, they did some rugs, they also did some rails around the special unit class. Um, they also brought us some sports equipment that we have been using at the special unit, in the entire school, and also during our national games. And as a school, Sana Andy, women is idea back up in Nimbefika, women in Nuriam to hearings, on an Olympia Shule. The project has come to an end, but the course is still on. We will come back bigger and better. To continue with this good work, we've launched second edition on Nico Educator Book Campaign, which is meant to fundraise for these children with disabilities. We intend to raise 10 million in 120 days to support around 100 kids. We are calling out on friends and uh, partners to support us. The campaign is running on our social media pages. So you can give as little as a hundred pop that will go along with what supporting a child with disabilities.